what then determines whether you're going to be successful. And I'd always been passionate about broadcast journalism. So I called a television station in New York, a local news station, and I asked them, what do I need to do to get a job with you guys? So unfortunately, I didn't have any experience, and so they said no repeatedly to me, and I decided I wasn't going to take no for an answer. So eventually, after emailing and pestering constantly, they eventually got back to me. They brought me in for an interview, and they were so impressed that even though I had no experience, that I'd put together this tape by myself showing what I could do, that they hired me on the spot. I say, trust your struggle. The second thing I believe is, I honestly do not believe in competition. I don't believe in competing for what I want. I believe in creating what I want. But I think that having a competitive spirit, having that need for one-upmanship, and comparing yourself to other people again and again, can actually bring out fears and insecurities that end up holding you back. And the last thing I'm going to say, and that is, success comes when opportunity meets preparation. Most people wait until they get the call for a job interview before they begin to prepare, or they wait until they get the call for an audition before they begin to rehearse. So to sum up, I truly believe in trusting your struggle, knowing that the hardships you go through will somehow end up being for your own benefit. I also believe in turning a blind eye to competition. I believe in giving, and I believe in trusting and knowing that your opportunity will one day come. You just have to be ready. Thank you.